there is there, there's been like BitTorrent and Tor, and then they, someone created Bitcoin, and then Ethereum created smart contracts on top of that. So it's like a ladder, and of course, Point Network is not the last step, right? So there, there will be other 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 entrepreneurs building something that someone might fork Point Network at some point and create something else with it, something extra. Uh, but, but yeah, Serge, I actually think it's a great moment to call out people that uh, are thinking about uh, decentralized apps. Uh, and thinking about joining projects to actually hit us up uh, at our social media or our email or something, and we would love to discuss it with you. Yeah, what I like about about our project is that it uh, seems to be a glue between uh, all these newest technologies of decentralization, like blockchain and open source driven de development, and and the real world applied. Uh, 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 websites and uh, applications that uh, so uh, it, it, it in my opinion uh, it is a very demanding uh, bridge between uh, this new uh, perspective technology and uh, people who really want to reach their auditory uh, directly not through some third party uh, big companies so yes Reach us directly at our G Suite uh, account. <laughs> uh, join at pointnetwork.io if you're a developer and if you work, want to work on something like that. Diane, uh, always remembering about operations. That's great. Thanks for reminding about that. Yes, if you want to uh, to work on something like that, you might. So you might work on Point Network itself, or you might be, uh, at some point decide to create apps on top of point network because we cannot we don't have the uh, you know we don't have the resources to build everything on top of it let's say decentralized email and decentralized social media and decentralized nft market we will try to to create like some first applications on it but then i think we will rely on many teams and funding other teams and providing grants uh, and so maybe uh, someone that's 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 listening to us maybe you're the next uh, What's this guy's name? Sergey Brin, right? That created uh, created Google, right? And you want <laughs> yeah. to create decentralized Google, and this is your this is your time because if you're gonna create the next Google, no one like Google has more resources than you. But decentralized Google may be the next thing that that, that can actually you know uh, that can actually compete because of this uh, decentralization factor. So yeah, that's uh, that's great if someone. To watch the full episode, click the first link in the description. If you want others to discover this content, please click like. And if you want more content like this, consider subscribing. Also chat with us in our Telegram group, which will be the second link in the description. See you there.